What is up, you people? Welcome back to Fit Couple Foodies again, back from New York. And back in Vegas. That's crazy because we were so sick, we couldn't do a cheetah here two That's weeks like, ago. Yeah. yeah, so we needed to come back and give you guys the material that you were looking for and want to have because we love Vegas. And what we promised at yes. home. <laughs> yeah, we did. We keep our promises, okay? <laughs> Always keeping our promises. So on the way home, we stopped. And you better leave a like and subscribe to the channel because we are going back to show you some donuts. So guys, you're in for a treat. Saint Honoré, baby. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> A little bit of a bummer, guys. It was like 10 minutes late. It was very, very picked out. Picked out. No, that's not how you say it. It was no, like almost no donuts left. But that is a good thing, guys. You gotta stay positive because now is the time we can try like three other donuts. Which we never would have taken if it was a full selection. Which we have last time. Yes. So now it's three new donuts. Yes. And we good. actually even tried to. We actually asked her if the other location had more and then she said no actually they are sold out too yeah. so obviously people are eating donuts on a wednesday yeah but that's weird though because they open to nine so it's gonna be like zero donuts left yeah hopefully they might be baking but all the baking is taking time so maybe so maybe we're like in just in the middle of the two but anyways i'm these, super excited like the this one we should start with that one i think like look at that chocolate salted caramel look at this one guys that looks nice. It looks really delicious. Some nail. So I'm gonna let my beautiful lady here take the first bite of this what? one. Will Go I in, start? big freaking bite. Okay. I see the caramel. Mm. Cheers. Very plain, if I can uh, read Ida's uh, face experience. Experience? It's so much dough, guys, it's insane. And that's it's a little bit stale today yeah so maybe we are just like this was Late. the end of the morning donuts so that it is like the end of yeah pretty good flavors but, but the flavor is really good um not the best one is this the time saint Henry is gonna go down in rating for us maybe we don't know mm, that was so good you know huh you like everything with sugar so no i know. don't <laughs> i'm just trying to add to like get a flavor of the chocolate and the salted caramel and that combination is really good see the battle on the next one this is filled with raspberry apparently yeah so a raspberry it's, jam filled it's really heavy are you not going for the battle i do yes you should okay cheers cheers mate look at you you're looking so cute like a santa oh wow yeah <laughs> oh wow one more i go in one more oh was it good was it a good oh look at the raspberry jam I have money shot in there. Ooh, all right. This looks like a good jam. Or was it? Mm. A nice lick. This mm. is much better. Yeah. That was approved. Yeah, it's not a 10 out of 10, but it's good. It's better than that one. So look at this beautiful one. I think this is another raspberry one. Yeah. almost the same as that one probably because the jam is on top on that one my favorite though i didn't think it was that one the raspberry feel i agree see how much dough it is guys but as i said i'm a little bit like the other time that we tried it it was just like maybe 10 times better the dough was softer more like i agree and they i like i've heard that they are more even than that and i kind of anticipated it to be more even so i'm a little bit disappointed but me too it's still like i mean we have food craze we need to tell you guys how it is yeah and last time maybe you need to be there in the morning maybe you actually need to be in the morning because yeah. these feel like they have been out for a lot of hours mm -hmm. um so this time i only would rate saint Honoré to maybe a six. six out of ten i agree and last time it was a 12 out of ten so. even ping pong was better last time yeah, but only the first day. The second day, Pink Box wasn't good either. That's why we picked the good donuts the yeah, first day. Yeah, of course, we always pick You know our shit, guys. Yeah. But, yeah, I'm still like... I'm actually kind of happy because I always go around and crave Saint Honoré. Yeah. And now I don't have to crave it. That's good, I agree. So, yeah. Okay, guys, that six was uh, 6 out of 10. But next meal is going to be savory, guys. And 
we hope that's gonna be really really nice I'm excited for that yeah yeah let's go but before we go there I was thinking that I just realized that I now know my top three donuts in the US yes donuts in the US Gordo. Gordo's Colorado and sidecar because all of those three are even they are staying on an even carnival level of really good donuts every yeah, time yeah of quality yeah and they are like they are like they are good never bad never bad I so agree. yeah that's my top three i have to agree yes so yeah side note side note <laughs> where are you at you see me yes now i see you take it easy roaster yeah let's see if they're open i yeah. think they are Someone is excited! I am very excited because we have a baked and also fried empanadas in front of us and I think that this might be a really wonderful thing. Yeah. How about you? Do you think it's gonna be a good one? I have wanted to have empanadas since we took that bite from our neighbor down in Venice. Yeah, because he is freaking fantastic. Yeah. And also, we are in a location we have never been to in Vegas. We are actually in Chinatown. Hidden gem in Chinatown. I'm so happy that we oh took... Oh my god, look! They have it like on... imprinted, so... Okay, I'm so hyped right is, now. This uh, is baked chicken tinga. And here is one queso fry... Uh, no, this is also baked. Yeah, uh, that's baked. Queso baked empanada. You can see who, that's what is baked yeah. Now, yeah. And then we have, uh, yes, so this is the berry one. Dessert. No, not berry one, the apple one. Yeah, the apple so one. So we have one dessert of going course. in there. And then we have a fried beef empanada. <laughs> this looks amazing. Oh balls. my goodness. And then we have the shrimp. Ooh, look I, at them, they look so I good. I really believe in this one. I really believe in this one too. And also one vegan, a mushroom one. That can be really good as well. I think so. So Look these are the ones that we have. We also <laughs> got uh, Americano. Which was a hit actually. It was really, really nice coffee. So dude, which one are you going to start with? <laughs> the beef. <laughs> the beef. That was cute. It's really hot. Okay, let's oh, see. Oh, but maybe it's too hot. Yeah, too hot. You're gonna burn yourself? Oh. Couldn't get any beef. But the freaking dough. Okay. Take another bite. Now is the beef time, okay? Too hot, too hot. Be careful. Nice. Oh, that looks amazing. Mm. Oh my god, that was so good, Ida. Was it? Mm. Okay, you have to try. Yeah. Fresh. Freaking solid. Mm. Oh, this, it's so cozy, guys. This is really cozy, and it's, fun. it's kind of good weather. It is. It's just like a little bit. It's it's not even chilly. It's just like. Yeah, I'm hot though. Yeah, I know you are. I'm packing close though. Okay, now you are going in for the chicken, right? Yes. Baked. So, oh, baked chicken empanada. Here we go. Oh. Oh. Mmm. Oh yeah. The beef is better. But do you think it's better fried or? Uh, it's better fried. You think? Yeah, but it's hot. Ah, okay, too hot. It's less Ooh. healthy though. Yeah, I. That's why I kind of like the. It was too hot. Sorry. Guys. It was fresher. Yeah. Oh, so hot. Ooh. Okay. Well, now I I need to go in for the shrimp. I'm yeah, super cool. excited for this one. I mean the the crunch. <laughs> I farted. How <laughs> did you hear that? No. What did it? No, he I only farted. Saw. He was like. Poof. Mm. Oh, it's dripping so much. Oh, your mm. shrimp is really good in flavor. It's like a shrimp mix. Mm. That was tasty. I think mm. that's better than the beef so far. Oh, wow, this is so good. Mm. Mm. Yeah, best so far. The shrimp, oh my god, it's good. Do you know what I'm sitting and thinking of? The feta. Peter. The peter. The peter. That was like the most ridiculous thing I've ever eaten. You have said the quesadilla. Yeah, the, be the, the, the mixed one. That was... The spices. Now in the afterhand? No, you don't say that. In the aftermath. It is a 12 out of 10. Yeah, it's, totally. It's one of the best places I've ever tried. Agreed. Just that one. The... Okay, okay, let's go for the mushroom. Ooh. Or should we go for a bake? No, no go mushroom. For that one. mushroom. Mushroom, mushroom. Ida is a, a mushroom fan, for sure. 
Ooh. Mmm, good. Mmm. Wow. Vegan, baby. Wow, this looks so good. It's like uh, turmeric in it too. The flavor of this one is the is the winner. This one rushed the other ones, and this the spiciness to it. Yeah. That is a winner for sure. You have to take that one. Mm. Wow. Oh my oh, wait, god. Wait, wait, wait. I really like the flavor of this one, but the others is kind of lame. If you compare it to this one. All right. Really good. Kiso, baked cheese, my friends. Are you just gonna... cheese? That's gonna be so good. Cheese pull, maybe. Oh, that looks also really empty. good. Is it empty? No, it's just the walls that... Oh, it's hello! <laughs> it's really empty. Ooh, but the flavor. The flavor of the cheese? It is cheese in there, guys. Oh my... Lord. Oh, okay. Either See? read that the, the cheese was one of the... the That's hits. why I took it, even though I thought it would be like a... Like a boring one, but the flavor of the cheese? Holy hell, but the mushroom is still the... The mushroom and the cheese, and then the shrimp. Agreed! Is the empanadas by our neighbor better? Yeah. They are what sick. I can remember though. Yeah, I, I think we need to go. I think we should try one of each next time. Yeah. But now I'm going in for the apple. Find out. Oh, I'm enjoying myself right now. Oh my god! <laughs> really? Very hot. Apple pie, baby. It, I, I'm not the biggest apple pie fan, but it, it actually it is re, actually really fun. Oh. It is a hidden gem and I highly recommend it. You too? Cheers. Cheers! See you at the next meal! Okay guys, we ended up at Cosmopolitan because they have like a lot of reviews that that is one of the best pizzas on the strip. Yes, and you guys know how we feel about pizza and we were supposed to actually get home, get dressed and get out tonight but... The okay. clock is ticking, it's, just, it's like crazy to do everything, Yeah, you know? the time just flies here, so yeah. You're gonna enjoy a, a white sauce pizza right now. Mm. I mean, it's not even half the size of the one in Hoboken. Yeah, the artichoke pizza, yeah, that, artichoke that was pizza. insane. It was thick and it was But big. I mean, the look of it looks very promising if you ask me. I could not agree more. Eight bucks pizza, let's, let's go. Eat. Cozy, right? Really cozy. Okay, should I go in first? Yes, I think you should. I mean, oh my god, the feel, look. It's just... That's stamp. how, that's how we approve the pizzas. Yeah, look at that. Did you hear that? Yeah. Was it that good? Was oh, it good? it's good, guys. I love pizza. The crust. That is good. With some chili flakes on. Mm. It's so buttery, crunchy, cheesy. Very delicious. Very delicious. This is 9.5. I would say an 8. 8.2. Really? Yeah. I really love this pizza. We might go for another spot very soon if we can we'll find go. it. Yeah. Right? Another really popular place. So let's yeah. go there and see if we can pick it up. Yes. We found the spot. Party people, we ended up at Lardo Sandwiches. <laughs> Guys, that is pulled pork shoulder with house-made kimchi. Chilmayo, cilantro, <laughs> and lime. <laughs> the memory. <laughs> this looks so good. It's fresh, spicy, and perfect. Mm. Oh, I wish we took one each. Oh, yeah. It's a 10 out of 10. I agree. We took the right one, and the bread is so freaking fresh. Okay, the cilantro in this one is crazy together with all the meat and everything. The sauce. Unfortunately, last bite. We will rate it a little bit more outside. Whoopsie daisy, lost files. Yeah, obviously, I don't know, I, I probably deleted the last few slides in this video. But oh. we are home though. <laughs> yeah, and we realize now when Henrik is editing the video that that file is gone. From yeah. when we said that we wanted to explain or rate Lardo the, sandwiches. Yeah, oh my god. 10 out of 10 if you go for the pork uh, Asian style thingy. Oh, that was so good. I yeah. want to just have a bite right again. now. Yeah. Because that sandwich was a straight 10 out of 10. And that was also the last meal for this Las Vegas cheat day, guys. And we hope you guys enjoyed it. And we hope that you give this video a like, that you smash that follow button or subscribe button to be 
uh, YouTube Frank. Yes. But with that said, guys, have a really good uh, week ahead. And oh, and also, we, we don't forget to subscribe, like Ida said, because next week we are coming back with an ultimate freaking cheat day from LA. And just... It's gonna be a blast because all of the places is already decided and it's yummy. It's gonna be super yummy. Take care, stay well, love you. Love you.